So I don't really get to wear hats very often, but since we're recording this in a new way, on an actual phone, uh, I'm able to actually wear a hat and earbuds, and it's kind of weird. Welcome back to Don Machi. Uh, this is going to be a bit of a weird video, I'm going to be honest here. Um, I'm starting out a new form of recording. I tried this with the Sao thing in the first place, but now I found a way to actually record the in-game audio straight out of the game. So I'm able to listen to it, hear it, be good to go, wear earbuds, and still be able to actually play. So I was... Oh, dear. Unplug my headset, accidentally. Uh, I was given uh, an account by several people, but the one I ended up choosing was from a friend of mine named Rising Hero 19 And in the account, you can see there's, there's, there's not really much right there. But if I... Shit. If I, if I click it properly, I can replace them with the number one waifu. Also, I'm going to go ahead and put the, the bell and the... Bakugo man on the team as well. But obviously, we all know, if I can even fucking click this for long enough to actually click it, we all know this girl, right here, was the one that I wanted the most. This is Chigusa. She is A+. Plus. And I did, unfortunately, remove a touching feature inside this game, apparently. Very unfortunate, because this, this would be a thing. But, that's how it goes sometimes. I'm gonna go ahead and toss Hestia on you. I'm gonna toss... No, 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 Wait a fucking minute. Why am I not just doing this? My leader has obviously got to be Chigusa. I'll just put eyes with this, you with the, the older woman, because obviously Belle loves her. And let's look at eyes as well, because I actually didn't get the chance to probably look at the bathroom princess. So this is the bathroom princess unit that I saw for like a moment on a loading screen as I was starting up this game. Then I found out the account actually has this. Which is beautiful. This is it's a beautiful time. I am very happy with what's happening. And let's go ahead and actually play the game now. Cause I feel like for the most part in the last episode, while we did play some, we didn't play enough. Uh, we didn't really actually show the game rather than actually just start and then barely do anything. So I'm gonna go ahead and skip to the story a little bit. This looks weird. Okay, let's go. Okay, the, the, the Bakugo man, the wolf furry guy, looks really similar to Bell on these screens, which is kind of weird. But, you know what? It's all good. I'm gonna go ahead and double the speed, and then we're gonna try to... Hmm. Honestly, it's probably fine if I just go and attack them automatically. Yeah, no, that, that, yeah. Honestly, like, so I've been watching a few videos on this. Um... There are a few people I like to watch. Some of them by the name of... Or feature a couple of letters. F and G, mostly. They're next to each other on the keyboard. It's kind of cool. Um, and I, I've, I've learned quite a bit, but at the same time, I am so fucking lost that I don't comprehend, I don't comprehend half of the things that are happening. Because here's the issue. I can understand mechanics where I'm playing it for myself. When I'm actually playing the game myself, I, I comprehend what the gameplay is all about. But when I'm watching a video, I just can't get that same sense of, like, this is what they're trying to do, and this is what uh, I'm meant to actually get out of this. Because it's it's an issue of a lack of fami familiarity, and as well as just not being at that point in the game to actually understand the mechanics. That's why the main issue with, like, me recording Tokyo Ghoul War Age is no one's there to see the new game modes, because for the most part, we don't really understand them. Uh, we're mostly there just to see the cool units and just do that, because shit happens, you know? Obviously, we, we comment on it and are like, wow, this one has a world boss of Eto. Wow. But other than that, we're kind of clueless. Additionally, the gameplay feels very lax. So uh, games like this with, like, hardcore stat averages and stuff like that usually feel very stressful. Uh, I'm sure if anyone has played a hardcore playthrough of Final Fantasy VII, which God knows I have. That shit sucks. So bad. Like, to be honest, any Final Fantasy game, if you run a hardcore run where if you lose a party member and they die, they're gone forever, it's gonna be a bad time. Because when you lose the protagonist, you're, you're, you're basically screwed. They, they, they base the entire game around that main protag being your the person you rely on mostly, basically. Uh, Final Fantasy VII without Cloud is like Final Fantasy VII without like, or it's like trying to play 
Skyrim as a villager. It's just not viable. And you can't level up at all either. It's it's just... It's hard, man. Things are hard. And not just because you're playing this game and they have towels and swimsuits on. Obviously. I'm gonna go ahead and see some animations for these slashes, actually. Let's see the illusion mech and the earth stab. Wow! That hits both! Holy actual shit. Okay, that is... Huh. I expected a lot... Hmm. Or she's something very different. Did, did she just say that she's embarrassed? I heard it. I'm not happy about it, but I heard it. Also, so Aya seems to be super slow to the point where she's like the last person to go and didn't actually get her illusion mech attack off there. Hmm. Not a huge fan of that, but whatever. Okay, low key, these models look really weird to be lewd. They look too sketch to actually... Oh, illusion mech! That was kind of lackluster, actually. It's okay, though. We'll, we'll just win this, but... Took zero damage. But for the most part, like... The legs look so weird, and the fact that they're bare are just like... The Chigusa, especially, just feels very sketch. It feels... I hate to say it, but it feels very lolly ish Also, I got an achievement! I don't know if that's gonna pop up on the recording, because I don't know how this shit works, but... We'll see in the future. I can go ahead and do some more Bell of the Crannels. Oh, I can interact? Can I can I touch them? No, because this is in the Japanese version, but I'm gonna see what we can actually do. You you know who I'm gonna fucking choose. You're right, Bakugo the furry. Let's do it. I can't even click him properly. Hey. You're in a hurry. I I can't touch you. I can't confirm that. I don't have any other outfits for you. I'm so sorry. You deserve so much better. What I, what I want? I just want to be here. Is that so bad? You have a story, apparently. You're a dog and monkey. I'm not going to actually read the story, unfortunately, but... I'll get your I'll get your iris off of that. Thank you. I still find it funny in the first video. Um, I... So... I didn't read that the, there was a guaranteed four star from the other gotcha. So I just kind of assumed that, like, hey, it's whatever, I'll just pick the other one. Oh, dear lord. Okay. Yep. Good morning. Good, good mo- Fluffy. She's fluffy. It's okay. God fucking damn. I just want to get past this. The sketch. Family of customs. Oh. I'm going to read this one, actually. We're going to- we're going to voice act, shall we? Oh, no. Bubble, bubble. Me too. <laughs> this feels sketch. Is that it? Okay, it wasn't it. Alright. Yeah, what you should do is you should all rub your bodies on him to get some... to cool him down. I feel like I'm, I'm like... I'm watching a visual novel. Oh no, why are you alone? Don't do anything. Uh-uh, this... Um... This is a doujin. This is, this is straight up a fucking doujin. すまんな迷惑ばかりかけてうん迷惑なんてみっともないな俺はえお前たちに迷惑ばかりいやお前たちだけじゃないあ、oh, this is actually like... Ah. Huh. Like a very real thing. That's not true. So I'll make you feel better. But... 
What bad call did you make that ended up with everyone in swimsuits? I don't remember this. I really don't remember this. Oh. She said, he said his own name! He said, he said Chigusa, but the subtitle said Oka. Thanks, Crunchyroll. でも。お前の苦しみも背負ってやれないようなら、俺はお前たちの団長である資格すらない。オカ。チグさん、お前は荷を下ろしていいんだ。It's kind of cute actually. I kind of like this. Holy shit, dude. チグさんはいつも通り優しく、みんなの拠り所であってくれれば、それで十分なんだ。See, I would say ship it, but I don't. Because she's my wife. それが俺団長の仕事だからな。ありがとうな、チグさん。話せて少し楽になった気がする。This still feels sketch. I'm sorry. Wait, who is Takemi Kazuchi again? I don't actually remember. I'm gonna Google this, because I'm actually kinda curious. Uh Take Mika Mikazuchi. And not Persona 3, no! Uh Don Machi, thank you. Uh oh, it's that fucking guy. I don't like him at all. Well, hey, I'm I'm glad we got to experience that. Let's go do some more fucking gameplay stuff. That sounds like a good time. Wait. Why I run. That's why I run. Well, in, in the end, when you say run, that's the point when Todoroki uses fire or something. I don't... Shit happens. Jokes. Let's go. I probably should be using the furry, to be honest. Like, I feel like I have mostly DPS right now, and that seems like a bad plan in games like this. Usually you need, like, a tank. You need, um... Like a tank, a DPS, a, a healer, and stuff like that, but like, I feel like I have three DPS right now. And maybe one tank and eyes? Because she's slow? I actually don't know. Hmm. Either way, it should be fine though. Because we're still we're, we're cruising through these levels. Granted, we're not at the end game difficult content, which apparently exists later on, but, you know. Alright. Stab him up. One and two. Bell can even one shot these lizards. What a shit, Lord. He needs to get better. Oh, that's it. Cool. I want to check out the gotcha to see what's actually available right now. Um, just to see if there's anything interesting. Uh, oh, I got Orario. No idea what that was. Probably should have read it, but it's too late now. God damn it. Uh, can I... Oh! I'm, I'm a rookie, but apparently I, I get things for... Oh! It wants me to change my party. I already did that, but you know what? I will switch out the, the furry guy in that case. Um. No one even seems like a good fucking plan. They all seem shitty. Sure, I'll use Big Sword Man. Just get the quest done at least. Cool. Nice. Oh, did that one too. Nice. Didn't do a talk yet, but I'll do that after. Wait, Bell CP level 2. I don't quite know what that's going to mean, but I'll take... Maybe they're talking about, like, any Bell unit has to hit level 2 or something. Hmm. I'm honestly not sure, but I'll take 10, 10 Iris. That sounds good. 
Honestly, I don't even know like what the the actual prices of scouts are. Two hundred actually ain't that bad. So I could have multiple Chigusas with like an Oka and uh, a Freya. Actually, seems quite quite good. Um, hmm. I. Oh god, I have to choose between Otari and Oka. Um. I don't know. I'm gonna choose Oka, I think. But Otari looks so cool. It's like a, it's like a straight up like, I'm gonna end this entire battle in one hit type of guy. You know what? We're gonna do. We're gonna do. Oh, that's a paid Iris one. Let's just do the first ten pull on the step up gotcha. I'm gonna grind up the orbs after this, but fingers crossed. I forgot how annoying the scout thing is, by the way. This, this, these nyas are the worst. Cool. Cool. Or if you just get nothing, the entire thing. That's only two stars. Cool. Just what I wanted. Yep. Sounds about right. Oh, three star. Hestia? It is a Hestia. That's another support. That's actually pretty good. It's a pretty... Pretty nothing... Like, pull, but... I'll take it. Okay. I need to talk to a character, first of all. That's one of the things. Here, Bell, do you want to talk? Uh, voice. Daily talk. Nice. I don't, I don't know why I need to click that to be able to get... Oh wait, no, was that not it? Where do I need to talk to them? Here? Oh, it's here! Interesting, okay. So that's how you level up CP. You play as them here and then talk to them. We also talk to them and you get CP for them as well. So I guess it's whoever you're playing as as well as whoever you talk to. Interesting. You look lewd. It's a good outfit. I appreciate you. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and go over here. Talk to Eyes, because obviously we, we all know that we care about her. I mean, she'll be good for now. Is that gonna... Yep, okay, that cleared. What else do we need to do? Change... I can do that. I can easily do... Hey, Hestia! Also, this this giant bag looks hilarious. Like, without being unlocked, but it's okay. Uh, Hestia, I need you to... Uh, get lewd. I don't really have anything, actually. Oh! God, that's actually kind of fancy. I'll take it. Now she is in the black outfit, which is kind of cool. Uh, oh, I need to clear more levels. Okay. Um, hmm. I'm tempted to just keep on playing until I can get another 10 pull, but that seems like it might be a little bit far away. I also think I'm going to go ahead and change uh, this guy back to the party, because that sounds a lot better. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna go and do a run now uh, to get to at least 2-5. That's gonna be our goal, and then I think that I'm gonna end off, because it has been already, like, 20 minutes. Holy shit, dude. Alright. I'm gonna... No auto-move. I actually wanna just control this myself, because I can... I can battle with the best of them. Like, go back and forth. Actually, you can't go back and forth very fast. I don't actually know if you can go backwards. Let me try. You can, but just not at a fast pace, because if I, if I do that, she struggles way too much. It's okay. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and use... Um... Chigusa's Earth Slash, so we can, she can just one-shot all of the enemies in one hit. There we go. Now you have to face the boss, but it shouldn't be too bad if I can just use the skills on Bell and, uh... Bakugo. Furry Bakugo. It should all be okay. I actually don't know what these things do, so let's find out. Firebolt, and that, and sure, you can illusion it up. God, remember the fucking scene where he just keeps on yelling Fire Boruto over and over. That's all I remember of the entire show. It, it, that's just it. Remember them bleeding at one point or something? There's it's not much. It's not much. Maybe I should rewatch that today. That might be cool. 
Hmm. I'm tempted. We'll we'll see. We'll see. Maybe today will be the day where I actually get back to Don Machi and realize it's actually a really good show. But apparently, it's a lot better than the typical like shitty slice of life show or shitty like isekai show. Wow, we are criticaling and one-shotting everything. I'll take it. Oh god, these lizards. Alrighty. I'm gonna stab you all. Have a nice day. Hell yeah. There's only two of them, so you're able to easily do it. The fact that you don't get the last two party slots until you level up a little bit, or like complete certain levels, is kind of weird, but it's not a huge deal. Okay, so Sh Chiguza should be able to one-shot these guys for the most part. There we go. And that's the final thing, I believe? Um, yes it is. Cool. Wow. Okay. You know, seeing the, the S ranks in all of these feels really good. The S rank just feels like you actually succeeded at doing something. You know how certain, certain things you don't really feel like there's a sense of progression towards things. Like in BBS, you don't feel happy completing a quest because you get a couple of stars and that's it. But in a game like this, you, you get an S rank and you're like, holy shit, yeah, it's a rainbow, I did good. It's like a four star completion rank. It's, it's, it's a weird thing, right? But I think it makes sense. Kind of like reward for your gameplay, but in a strange way. It's weird. It's real weird. All right. Ugh. I am gonna go ahead and Chigusa Earth slash everyone. Jesus. Okay, yeah, she doesn't. She does not care about anything. I am really happy I have her actually. Thank you, Rising. Holy shit, dude. All right, and the final thing for this episode. We're gonna go ahead and just finish off two five. Let's auto move for now. Also, the thing is, like, I want to get a better case for my phone as well, because it's kind of, like, lacking for the most part right now. Uh, I feel like it could be really cool if I have, like, oh, th this case is an exclusive Pokemon Go- I don't fucking know. Something- something fancy. What's well, four of them. Can I one-shot all of them? Apparently, eyes penetrated them, which is kind of cool. And hot, in its own way. That is not a good thing to say. Not a good thing. Uh-uh. Uh, that is... Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, jeez. She did not give a shit. So she can use two Earth Stabs in the same level string? That's fantastic. Okay, hopefully I have another AoE attack. No, because Fire Bolt doesn't actually do nerve effect. Though Illusion Mech does hit backwards, so it does hit the people behind the guy as well. Good to know. Good to know. So now I have an AoE, I have a, a row, and I also have two single shot, kind of just hits, they're not even that great, but it's alright. Interesting. Very, very interesting. I'll go ahead and claim this, and I think we're going to be done for now. Um, thank y'all for watching. Wait, rank up Adventurer Bell to 2 star. Is that a thing I can do? Adventurer Bell. Is this Adventurer Bell? It is Adventurer Bell. Okay, well, do you want, um, this? I, I can't give you any of those. I don't know how to rank up to 2-star. Honestly, I have no idea how to. Status board? Oh god, I swear to god, if it's like a skill tree that I have to rank up for a 1-star, I'm gonna be super upset. I have no idea. No, that is the rank up. Yeah, that's, yep. Okay. Release all. Cool. Rank up. Raise level to max. God fucking damn it. Okay. I guess I'm going to do that next time. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. Uh, let me know if you are a decent fan of the way that this new recording setup is going. The issue is like, I don't feel like I'm making enough contact. I don't feel like I'm here enough. That's weird, but you know. Anyway, see you later and take it easy.